right, we're going to make some elderflower cordial with these gorgeous elderflowers that the children picked this morning. You can't smell these, but they smell absolutely lovely. Uh, right, so quite simple. We need elderflower heads, sugar, citric acid, and two lemons. So our first job is to put the sugar and the citric acid in a big bowl. Just like so. Actually, I'm going to add that after the boiling water because I've been caught out with that before. If you put boiling water with citric acid too soon, then it makes it go a bit loopy. So we'll just let the boil go off a little bit. And I haven't weighed that out, but I'm guessing there's about a pound and a half with that. So we're going to give that a stir. <coughs> well, it's laughing at me in the background. <coughs> Sonia is our very able cook. There's all these sorts of things, so I must not in on this. So we'll just give that a stir and let it dissolve, and now I'm going to add the citric acid. <coughs> there we go, quite simple. Now we're going to slice the lemons. And they go in as well. This is such a lovely summer drink to make. And so simple. There we go, two lemons. And now we're just going to put um, my recipe says for 15 elderflower heads, but we're just going to do a bit of guesswork on that again. Mm. I've just cut the big bits of the stalk off. That one's only just coming out, but I think that's okay. And you should be able to find elderflower in any of your lovely Lincolnshire hedgerows. It's beginning to smell lovely already. Lemony and elderflowery. Give those a little push down. And then we actually have to cover this and leave it for up to five days and let it do its work and take in all those lovely elder particles. <coughs> I've got all these so I'm going to use them. There we go, one more. There. It doesn't look great in there, but it's going to do wonderful things. So we have to stir this daily, and after five days, we're going to strain this through some muslin, and that will make a cordial for which you add water or sparkling water if that's what you prefer, um, and enjoy as a drink. There you go.